What is up, guys? We are back with some more Pokemon Sword and Shield Isles of Armor DLC playthrough. Uh, so, we completed the second trial uh, with Flying Colors, and now we're out here to battle Avery, and whoever wins will win the third, or will complete the third trial, and we also get the secret armor. So there's Avery now, all excited and all that stuff, because he wants to win the armor and thinks he's better than us. So, you've come at last. Defeating you will grant me the secret armor. Then I will at last have what I need to become a psychic type gym leader. No matter what it takes, I refuse to accept anything but a complete and utter victory. I'm coming at you with everything I have. Are you prepared? Oh, uh, you look a he looked kind of crazy there. Looks like you two are. The two of you are ready. Good luck. I'm cheering for both of you. Alright, you two. Take your place. How the heck? How did you get over here? <laughs> Boy! <laughs> what? Is, they doing a lot of anime stuff now. Now they, they make it old people OP as heck. They be like the... the the most buff person out here. The Masters Dojo final trial. Ready? And go! Let's go, Avery. Let's see what you... Now you just have four, and then it's not even bald. It got to be kittens me, bro. It got to be kittens me. You yeah, ready? You yeah, ready? Let us have an elegant battle worthy of being called a finale. Prepare to sink into despair into the weird battlefield beneath your feet. You're like, okay, cool story, bro. He got a hidden ability on his, uh, on his ponytail? Um, uh, guess we'll ch shadow ball you. Pokemon? No, it's Pony Top Painted, bro. What you mean? Are, are you alright? Oh, uh, shoot. Yeah, you can learn Surf. What what just happened there? I couldn't use Shadow Sneak. I know I know I can't wait for Evolve in though. It's kind of crazy, like, I wonder if they thought we were going to be, like, exploring out here, because the rate at which he's training his team is pretty interesting. Wow, that was a crit. I'm glad he evolves his Pokemon now. Oh snap, so now we're about to experience uh, the Slowbro. We shall awaken our true psychic power here and now. Ah oh, yeah, there we go. Well, <laughs> you're doing it. I'm doing it. <laughs> The 
one, two, three, this Pokeball will grow gigantic. I guess it's safe to say no, uh... No Galarian or Gigantamax form confirmed for slow burn. Show boy, boy, beat the bricks off you. Oh, I could just imprison myself for this. The victor has been decided. The one to complete the third trial is you. Hooray, hooray. That was amazing. What a fierce battle. Oh, well done. You both gave it your all. You gonna put some respect on my name finally, or what? It appears I have lost. <laughs> How pathetic. I lost even though I resorted to such underhanded tactics. Uh, underhanded tactics, there we go. I don't think young, capable children like you can understand how I feel. I am just an average man who gave everything he possibly could. Perhaps it's time I stopped playing around and gave up my dream of being a gym leader. After the less than reputable things I did, I'm likely to be expelled from the dojo. Marquis. You are free to tell the master about the awful things I did. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sorry for what I did. Oh, no need to tell me. You can't hide anything from little old me. M master. I should apologize on Avery's behalf, too, as his master. What he did was wrong, but he just didn't want to be beaten by his rival. That's all. He's a good, hardworking student. <laughs> master, I thank you. You have my apologies. As for your punishment, Avery, you're going to look after the Pokemon in the dojo for six months. By yourself. What? What? Is that, is that all I have to do and you'll forgive me? Of course. Let's work on strengthening your heart. Uh, okay. All right, everyone. Things are settled here. I'm so proud of you both. You must have so much effort and tried so hard. I got so teared up that I couldn't even see half the battle, but what I saw was amazing. So moving. I'm tearing up. Marquis, you gave it your best in triumph, even when faced with an unfair challenge. To you, who has completed all the trials, I grant the secret armor of the Master Dojo. It'll take some time to prepare, so I'll go ahead and get things sorted. And that's all, gang, as you were. Pardon me, um... Marcus, I... Okay, we got a lead card. I will admit to acknowledging your strength just a little. Alrighty, so... Let's talk to you and see what's what's going on here. Ah, there you are, Marquis, keeping this old man waiting. Mm -hmm. Since you've completed all three trials, I give you the secret armor of the Master Dojo. This Pokemon is in fact the secret armor of the Master Dojo. Say hello to Kubfu. I know, I know, it's tiny, but raise it with diligence and it'll become strong enough to see you through any battle, just like a suit of armor. No opponent will be able to get past it. This one in particular has amazing potential. Problem is, it's a bit shy. It just doesn't seem to have much confidence in itself. So I was thinking, Marcus, maybe if it joins you on your adventure, that'll help it break out of its shell a little bit. So take good care of Cub Fu, okay? It's in your hands now. Oh, come here, little Cub Fu. If 
Kapu pulls the long white hair on its head. Its fighting spirit heightens and powers wells from the depths of its belly. Uh, we're adding you to the party. Um, I'm thinking I'm gonna do. A, I'm, I'm gonna take Umbreon out. Uh, this item in the bag. Now then, the first thing for you to do is become best friends with Kafu. You need to build trust. Kafu hasn't really had a chance to explore the world outside of the Jodas, so maybe it'll help you become better friends if you let it have a look around. Maybe take it to a spot that has a great view of the Isles of Armor. I have my students standing at good spots, so just keep an eye out. <laughs> and of course, having battles or camping out together will also help you become friendly towards each other. What else? Oh, I know. I hereby grant you permission to keep a Pokemon out of its Pokeball here on the Isle of Armor. You can now let the Pokemon at the head of your team out of its Pokeball and take it for a stroll. You'll be friends in no time if you walk together. Go and take a stroll with Kung Fu, why don't you? Once your best buddies, we'll start Kung Fu's training in earnest. Just stop by and let me know once you think you're ready. Okay, so they're just telling us to max out the friendship. That's, that's what it looks like, uh, to me at least. So, let me talk to you real quick. Uh, let's first move you out front. So fi finally, guys, we got what we wanted, which was a uh, Pokemon outside of the Pokeballs. But I believe that we can only take them outside their Pokeballs while here on this DLC map. I'm just going to use that just, just to have it ready. I don't even... Put the wrong one. So let's see. They gave us a jolly, a jolly one. So you know, rock smash, let your focus energy. Okay, that's not bad at all. So let's uh, head on out and see what we can do. It says become friendly with Kung Fu. Actually, I have um, a suit though. That's what I can. That's what I can give Kung Fu a suit though. And that should help max out uh, its friendship even faster. Yep. I just wish I could have chose like a Pokeball for it. I would have put it in like a luxury Pokeball. All right, so I'm connected to the internet as you can see. So there will be other people running around. If you're playing right now and you're on this, you might see yourself. Oh wait, how did she get hers to be? Oh, so you can, sh oh snap. So you can change up the color on those things with ease like that. Okay, so if I want to customize my outfit, uh, it looks like I'll be able to put maybe blue there. I don't know, I have fighting right on right now. So let's see what it looks like with the fighting type. Oh, dang. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, now it makes sense. So, now we just have to look for, I guess, great spots that his students are at in order for us to, I guess, get closer with our Cub Fu. She just keeps moving around. What did you see? Nothing important, basically. <laughs> I just want to like see at first what it's going to be like. Uh, oh, there's a Pokeball over there. I just want to see like what the, these like great views are supposed to look like. Okay, well we found one person. You're getting more friendly with Cub Fu. I sure do. Oh, wait. I was like thinking that this was an area that I'd never been at before, but 
A bag of pre-cooked burgers. Why is there just a bag of pre-cooked burgers out here? But no, we've been in here. Uh, or I've been in. Oh wow, look at time. I'm gonna cut out all this stuff of me just riding around and doing X, Y, Z. This is all just so I can find those locations to keep Cub Fu's friendship up. Alright guys, here's another spot to be on the scenes with it. I don't know, I think I'll just skip this to where you guys are just gonna see like Cub Fu with Max uh Max friendship. Oh, so maybe there's only three we need to see. Oh yeah, like and rock. Did I just see someone jump? Did they just jump on Oh no, they didn't. Okay, they went up hill. I thought there was like a gap there. Alright, we finally found uh, another, another great view, even though it's kind of weird to call it great since you can't see that much. Okay, now we're best friends, so... Master Master should be really happy to see how well you get along. So I guess now we're supposed to uh, bring it, bring it up to uh, to Master Master. Wait, what the? What does the exclamation mark mean? I don't know what the exclamation mark means, but we're going in here to show show off what's going down in here hmm if only someone no but who would gather that many what's going on girl what's bothering you oh just the person i wanted to see tell me do you collect watts yep of course you do you're such a pro i'll have you know that the watt business here is positively booming right now around here they say that those who hold the most watts hold the key to success. I've actually been trying to gather up watts to spruce up the dojo a bit, get some more gear, but both my darling hubby and my son are more the indoor types, you know? And it's pretty hard for me to collect that many watts all on my own. If you ever happen to have some watts to spare, I'd be glad to take them. Oh, but I wouldn't ask you to give them to me and not give anything in return. This would be a business transaction, of course. I'll reward you with, with our generosity. Whenever you come, have extra watts, simply come and talk. Uh, let's see. Okay, so upgrading with the watts will allow more features in here. Okay, that's pretty cool. Since we've gathered over 10,000, I can order a Rotomi terminal. I oh, like the... Uh, like the PC box? Yep. So what, is every 5,000 a checkpoint? So that's kind of cool, you can upgrade your dojo. <laughs> How didn't you know what your your stuff was, oops, not 50,000. Okay, so. First, 5,000. Second, 5,000. Third is 10,000. Could you send someone right over? We want it to work. <laughs> now that's the taking care of, let's fire it up. Oh, 
Okay, well, let's go talk to him. What's this? What's this? Let's see how you and Coco are getting along. Good, good. You two are just the best friends now, aren't you? Coco's really become more confident. How wonderful. I dare say I think you're both ready. Follow me, you two. gonna take us to that tower all the way out there near the lichen rack dum dum dee dee la da dee da Whew. I guess it's as good a spot as any now then if you want to become stronger there are special training grounds just for Kung Fu prepare yourselves for the Tower of Two Fists the blue tower is the Tower of Waters, and the red tower is the Tower of Darkness. Choose wisely, since you'll only be able to climb one of the two towers. Kung Fu's fighting style will change depending on the tower you choose, and the type it gets will change as well. Think carefully. Each tower is five stories tall, and each floor has a tough opponent waiting for you. Make sure you level up Kung Fu properly before trying to climb up. You can reach both of the towers by heading through the forest to focus. You might even be able to find a shortcut if you can ride your bike across the river. I'm really looking forward to when you two make it to the top of one of those towers. It's going to be so exciting. Okay, yeah, we we just got to train our, our little cub flew up. Oh, I thought that white screen was bad. It never did that before. So, we got the soothe bell on it, but that's not the item I think I want it to have. Um, funny enough, I'm going to put the spoiler there. <laughs> and you guys should know why. Uh... I even have that there to begin with, or put it on him. Let's see what all can you learn there. It doesn't look like you can, oh, you can learn Fire Punch. I like how they gave us, um, they gave us a Jolly Cub Fu. Either they give you a Jolly Cub Fu all the time, or I just got lucky and got Jolly. We'll get rid of that. So fire punch, ice punch, I don't know. That sounds kind of kind of funny to me. Uh, so guys, I think I'm going to end this episode off here. Um, I'm going to train up Cub Fu. I'll probably do some raids till then just to speed it up so I can again record more videos fast for you guys with that said leave a like for the video it helps out the video a lot also subscribe to my channel if you're enjoying the content so much because it also helps me know you guys are enjoying the channel and what i'm putting out there so for those that use discord if you haven't joined my discord server yet please do the link is in the description below it's uh, a server filled with me and my friends and we talk about and play together on different video games if you're on Twitter, I'm barely on Twitter, but I have a Twitter just to interact with you guys personally. So if you're on Twitter, want to follow me, the link is also in the description of the video, and I hope you guys enjoy. With that said, stay sharp, guys. Later.